Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I have a very important message as it relates to your world and how you can actually change your world, how you can manifest a new world based on what you feel when you go to sleep at night and what you can do throughout the day to change all these things, okay? So if something happens to you throughout the day, like you have somebody that treats you in a way that you don't like, like if you're upset about that, it's something against your integrity or your beliefs and you just really are upset at someone for doing something to you in your world, this is this is created from you. You are actually writing and producing your own script from yesterday. Like today, the things that happened to you in your world today are all being written and produced from your feeling states yesterday. Like a movie, say you're creating like a movie and your world is the movie, okay? So you're, yesterday you have scripted and you wrote that movie for today. So everything in your world that you experienced today, you wrote and scripted that yourself and producing that in the screen of space in front of you today. So if something happens to you today that you don't like, like if somebody treats you badly or something negative happens to you, you wrote that script yesterday. And you can't affect that by trying to change your world and telling this person you don't like it. Like That's like watching a movie that you you were the producer and the director of a movie yesterday. You created a movie and then you, that you're watching the movie today and you don't like what one of the actors are doing inside the movie. But you, you're the one that wrote the script yesterday for that actor and you're getting upset at this actor within this movie. You're saying, this actor isn't doing a very good job and they're making me feel horrible. I don't like the negativity. But you actually wrote that script unconsciously yesterday by what you fell asleep with the feeling of the person that you were yesterday that person that fell asleep yesterday to that is what wrote and directed and published the movie of the screen of space that you're actually experiencing today you wrote the script today you wrote the script for your life yesterday with your feeling states as you went to sleep yesterday but you can change this you have the privilege of changes because you have a certain set of of skill you have a certain skill set which all human beings have is uh, their present moment awareness and you have the ability to change that by watching this movie and getting these instructions from me so i'm teaching you how to do this right now so you have you're a human being and human beings have that ability to expand their consciousness and actually change things change what they're directing change what they're publishing and scripting these actors to do in your 3d world so you change this by falling asleep by changing your being your personality falling asleep in the feeling of your wish fulfilled or or the feeling uh, that everything is going is, is working out for you beautifully that everyone treats you well and what would that feeling be ask yourself these questions as you're going to sleep at night like how would i feel if my world was absolutely perfect i was in the perfect relationship i, I had the perfect physique my life was working out perfectly everyone treats me perfectly my life is absolutely perfect and how would i feel right now if that were if that were taking place and you can do this through scripting you can do this through affirmations you can do this through visualizing as you're going to sleep at night and then creating this entirely new version of yourself as you drift into your subconscious lover at night and then when you do that you're actually writing and scripting an entirely new movie for tomorrow and just by understanding this is how this all works and the screen of space and the 3d hologram that you're living in is being created this way you can actually change this throughout the day by redirecting yourself throughout the day and by reacting and not reacting because the only free will you have during a day is what you react to and what you don't react to everything else is already scripted and it's already taken place yesterday and it's being projected on the screen of space today but you can change that by what you're reacting to and a big part of this is understanding what i'm telling you right now and once you understand once you understand that then you're no longer going to be upset at your world you're no longer going to be pointing the fingers at him, her, and him for treating you this way. Oh, this person treated me so badly. I don't like you. But really, you start understanding that you're the one that wrote the script for what they're saying to you. You wrote that script. So if somebody is treating you like you don't want to be treated, you wrote that script yesterday. You're the one that wrote, actually wrote that script and handed it to them. And they are just, they are projecting or they're telling you, they're writing, they are reading your script in their minds and producing that effect in your world. So anything that happens to you in your 3D world is created by you. You wrote that script yesterday for that person, but you can change this. And understanding what I'm telling you in this video, you can stop reacting badly to the things in your world and the things that are happening because when something bad happens to you in your world, you can now look within yourself and then you understand, you're like, okay, so I didn't like what, the way this person treated me. I don't like the way my life is going this way, but I ultimately created that yesterday. I wrote this script, so let me change it. I'm not gonna react to this. I'm gonna react positively 
to what's happening and understand why it's happening this way, okay? And then tonight, I'm going to change it. So, And today, I'm going to change it by not reacting and understanding that I'm the one creating it. But tonight, I'm going to visualize... I'm going to visualize an entirely new world that everything's working out for me perfectly. And the people that I want in my life, I'm going to change all that. You know, I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to create a new being for myself, a new personality, a new con- a concept of self. And I'm going to fall asleep with this new version of myself tonight. And then I'm going to write a new script for tomorrow. And you can master this. You start mastering this, this technique. You start mastering this technique and start and stop blaming the projection, the screen of space, which isn't real. It was actually scripted by you yesterday. You stop reacting to this, and then you start recreating the world for your future. Then you start realizing that you are actually a particle of God, and it's all being scripted this way, and it's actually a hologram, a virtual reality, a high-tech simulated game that you're living in that you're designing and directing and publishing yourself. And then you could change all this. Once you start understanding it, then you're like, okay, so I want to live a different life now. I want to live a good life. Why wouldn't you want to live a life where you're not in conflict or you're not being hurt? Or you're not, or you're, or you're not be feeling appreciated or supported. You want to, you can change all this because if you're feeling unsupported, you're feeling unloved, or you're living in lack, you wrote the script for that yesterday. But you have the privilege of changing that. Start changing that today by changing your present level of being, your concept of yourself, which Neville Goddard covers in the Power of Awareness, which I've covered multiple times and broke it down in videos in a sequence of videos on my channel that most of you have already seen but you can write a new script tomorrow. So if your life today isn't the way you want it to be, you don't point fingers. You don't say, I don't like you. I don't like you. I don't like the way you're talking to me because you wrote that script. You actually wrote that script for that actor in your movie to say that to you, to do that to you, to treat you that way. Change it by, cha- by falling asleep with a new version of yourself, a new concept of yourself by visualizing, scripting, falling asleep to my meditations in the perfect world. Fall asleep in the perfect world, the world where everything is working out for you perfectly. Like my grandfather used to say, he used to go to sleep with this big smile on his face every single night. I'd, I'd watch him because I'd get everything ready for him because he, you know, he was very, very old at that time. So I would prepare everything for him before he went to sleep and make sure that everything was just the way it was supposed to be for him. But I remember every night that he would lay down, like he would, everything would be perfect. He'd make his bed perfectly. Everything would be set just perfectly. And he would lay down in his bed with this huge smile on his face as he was going to sleep and everything is just working out for me perfectly and every and at night you could tell like a certain time would hit like eight o'clock would come and then his personality would change he would just be so grateful like he would be in this state of gratitude and appreciative and love he would just have this overwhelming being about himself as he's drifting or preparing to go to into his subconscious lover he was just preparing this whole entire new world this new feeling state, like hours before he's even about to go to sleep, he's, he's slowly transitioning himself to be in this state of gratitude and appreciation for the world that he's living in. So he's, he's writing the script for his world tomorrow through his feeling state of being supported, of being loved, of being pre- appreciated in his life, regardless of what his world is, was today, regardless of what happened today. He's writing his script for tomorrow. So you can all do this by changing that, by feeling loved, feeling supported, feeling all of these things that you want as if they're happening to you right now as you drift to sleep. And then that will happen to you. That will happen to you in the coming days, the coming weeks. And you can start mastering this and you'll start noticing things start to change. Like you fall asleep, you know, with a new version of yourself tonight. And then tomorrow you'll see something subtly change. You'll see sometimes a lot of things will change. But you'll see something subtly change and you'll be like, wait a minute, I did that. I created, okay, so I fell asleep with this yet last night and then I wrote the script for this today. Then you start noticing it and then you start mastering it. Then you can like start tweaking it and start changing it and understanding what you're falling asleep with every night is actually creating and writing the script for the movie that you're going to be living in tomorrow. So you can write your own scripts based on your personality, your conception of yourself as you're falling asleep. And this is very easily done. It can be easily mastered, but you must first understand the fundamentals that this world that you're living in right now, today, was scripted and produced and directed by you yesterday. So don't react to anything bad that happens to you. Look within yourself, rewrite the script today, change your concept of self and fall asleep with that new concept. And the subconscious mind will produce that in your outer world tomorrow because The subconscious mind doesn't know the difference between right and wrong. 
left and right, hot and cold. It only knows what you tell it. What, where you, where, what world are you living in as you're drifting to sleep? And then that is impressed into the subconscious and then projected on the screen of space and scripted a, an entirely new way for tomorrow. And you can change this, start mastering this. So start mastering this, start going within yourself and understanding that the world you're living in right now is actually scripted and produced and directed by your feeling states yesterday as you were drifting to sleep. But you can change all that today and understanding that you can change all this today and not reacting to you know what's going on in your life. So if something happens in your world today that you don't like, just understand that you're the one that wrote that script. You're the one that wrote the script that, that, that this person is not doing what you want them to do. Rewrite the script tonight. Change it. Even visualize something specific if you want to. You can, you can actually change things specifically you know, in your world. And you can actually change something. Like if you were to visualize and, or somebody telling you something specifically, you can actually fall asleep tonight with this person telling you this, this thing. Like this person absolutely loves you. They're completely in love with you now. Or you, know, you can do certain things like this and tweak this thing specifically if you want to. And then follow asleep with that the next day that person will come to you out of nowhere and tell you exactly what you imagined as you went to sleep but this is all in your ability to master this technique so you can start using this you can start using this or if you just want to do this like in a in a like a foundational or a fundamental way just changing your life like not specifically but just falling asleep with this feeling that everything's working out for you perfectly like a broad range of things you can just fall asleep like to my meditations that i produce where you're falling asleep in this new state of, of gratitude and appreciation and love and your your world is working out your for you perfectly and you have all the money that you can spend or you're in the best relationship ever falling asleep with me actually impressing you with this version of yourself and you're falling asleep in this feeling that you're now in this world where everything's working out for you perfectly so just remember that when you're going through your day and everything that's happening to you throughout your day that you can actually change it and the things that you experience throughout your day have already been written produced and directed from your feelings yesterday as you impress that into the subconscious mind then the subconscious mind then projected that movie for you today from yesterday and then today for tomorrow and then for tomorrow then the next year and then it goes on like that it keeps keeps going like this over and over and over and over so but you can change this now and just understand that's why i want to make this video to help you understand that and what you fall asleep with creates your world because that's the when you impress the subconscious mind that's when you actually lose unconsciousness and then drift with your new being whoever you are being with that concept of self and if you would like to discuss this further with me you can actually dm me in the neville goddard community which is in neville book which is in the description below that's the second link from the top that is neville book the neville goddard community where you can instant message me if you want to have further discussions about this so, all right i love you guys very much and if there's anything you guys want me to expound on leave that in the column box below and i read every single question and comment that you guys leave in the description below so leave any comments or anything you want me to clarify or any videos in the future that you want me to cover and i will do that and don't forget to give me one thing you guys are grateful for in the box below as well i love you guys and i'll see you guys in the next video